Hello and welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Hannah, I'm an Orthodox Jew and I make videos about my life. As you can see, I'm moving, please ignore the boxes. Today, I want to do a video of a TJ Maxx, Marshalls, not haul, cause I've gotten these things over time, but just things that I've gotten from those stores because they can have a really good SNES finds. So for some things, I don't remember what, what I got from TJ Maxx or from Marshalls, but honest to God, they're the same thing. Um, it's the same company. I think one of them just doesn't sell women's shoes or men's shoes, one of those. I used to work for TJ Maxx and I asked what the difference is and essentially there is no difference. Um, so anyway, I will show you all the things that I've gotten over the years from TJ Maxx slash Marshalls. Okay, so this skirt is the first thing that I want to show. I actually got it pretty recently. It's really nice. And a life hack with these types of skirts is, I'm not wearing it right now, anything right now, cause it's warm outside, but you can wear leggings underneath and like roll it up so you can't see. I mean, this is a pretty long skirt, but you'd have to roll it up a little bit. And that way they don't peek through. And then you can wear this skirt without tights and it's still warm enough. And also something that I've worn with this skirt is this sweater. I apologize that it's wrinkly. Again, I'm filming this in the summer, so I have this folded up, but it's pretty warm. This is Vince Camuto, again, from either TJ Maxx or Marshalls. And I can pair these, and then in theory, I could wear leggings underneath, and even with a jean jacket. And this is like a pretty warm outfit, but it doesn't look classically like a winter outfit. So I really like this. Um, I also, it's in the wash, but I have a shirt from Old Navy that's like right to my elbow. It's like a little bit oversized, and it's blue. I think it would look really nice with this skirt. It's like super flowy, really fun. Um, definitely glad I got this skirt. I could also wear, and I have worn this skirt with a denim with, sorry, this shirt with a denim skirt. Um, again, when it's warmer, I'll wear like tights or leggings and I can wear blundstones or like black rain boots. Um, but that's really fun. And of course a classic black skirt. This would look really good with a maroon skirt. I don't have one, but I really want one. And I think it'd look nice with a maroon skirt also. So yes, really good purchase of this shirt. Very versatile. And I think this like seam down the middle is kind of cool. This skirt might look familiar. Um, at one point it was my YouTube like, profile picture situation. I got this last summer. It's really nice. I can show you more of the detail as flowers. I love good floral skirt. And then I'll usually wear it with either this plain white shirt or I have a plain black shirt that I wear with it also. Really fun. Really good summer skirt. So this dress I've actually only worn twice. I took it from my mom. It's a little big on me and like makes me look very big. So I don't really wear it, but I think it's beautiful. Um, it has this really cool detail. It has flowers, which I love. And it's lightweight. I actually wore it one time in the winter and I wore a shirt under it, which you couldn't see, but it just made it warmer and it was really nice. It is a really pretty dress. It just, again, I don't know. Is it like... Let me know if you think it's like cool big or it just like is too big on me and I need a smaller size. But it is really nice to that this was an option at TJ Maxx. This is a really great shirt. It's super comfortable, just easy to throw on with a black skirt. I don't really wear this shirt with any other skirt besides a flowy black skirt. It's just the vibe. The shirt's like on the thicker side. Um, so it's good for obviously winter and then also like the beginning of spring and then like that fall transition period as a pocket, which I don't know, sometimes I put my phone in or like my car keys and it just drags down. But it's really, it's so simple. Like it's so simple to throw on. Looks great. Yeah, I don't even remember when I got this shirt. Like it could have been before seminary, but I honestly don't remember. But it just, it's just such a good shirt. This shirt, super easy. I got this. Oh, there's a stain. I've never noticed that. Okay, I got this around... Pesach 2021 like I was home for a wedding right before Pesach and I went to Marshall's with my mom and I got this shirt it's like fuzzy inside I don't know if you can tell so it's like warmer so I definitely could wear this in the winter I wear it either with this skirt or with a pencil skirt um and it looks good it's warm it's comfy it's perfect so these next few dresses my mom got me so shout out mom and the cool thing about that is she chose some dresses that I don't think I would have chosen for myself, but because she got me and I tried them on, I was like, oh, I actually like that. So this is definitely the case with this dress, which I will show you. This Shabbos dress, 
obviously has flowers because what else do I wear? And it's buttons like totally, like I could totally open it. Um, and it comes with this like tie thing. It kind of goes in at the waist. It's a good length. I don't love this like split thing, but whatever. It's really nice. It's, I don't actually think I wear it in the winter just because I feel like it's a weird length. I don't know. It's possible it could work with black tights, but this is more of like a summer late or like early fall dress that I could totally wear a shirt under that like no one can see but it, it would keep me warm can you tell I go to school in upstate New York <laughs> so yes good job mom another dress that my mom picked out it's so cute it's very very lightweight um the only I have two complaints about this dress one the sleeves are sheer so I'm wearing a shirt under you like can't even tell it blends in so nicely but I am um, and I've worn this in the winter before with a much thicker shirt. This one is cropped and it's like to my elbow, but in the winter I'll wear a thicker one. That way I can still wear it because as you can tell, and I've talked about in different videos, I really like it when an outfit can be good for multiple seasons. So that's how I'll do it. So my one critique about this dress is that I do have to wear a shirt under, which is like not ideal for the summer, but it is what it is. It's a cute dress. My second one, it rips like kind of a lot. Do you see that? And the first time I wore this dress, I had a rip. Was it on this side? Maybe it was on this side. And I know how so, and it was on the seam, so I fixed it. But I feel like that shouldn't happen. But I do really like this dress, so I need to fix that. Okay, that's on the to-do list. This is the same dress, basically, just in a different color. Um, You can see my shirt under more. At least in person you can. I'll show you. It's here. Um, Whatever. I don't mind. Again, I can wear this in the winter. It's really nice. It's like a little bit darker, so different mood. It does still have some red and some color, but it's mainly black. In the grouping of dresses that my mom got me, this is the last one. I think there was a fifth in that pile, but it didn't fit or I didn't like it, something like that. This is definitely an out there dress for me. Um, I don't think I would have tried it on or like picked it, but my mom got it for me, so I tried it on. I was like, wait, I actually like it. In the past, when I've worn it, I'll do, like, a safety pin situation so I don't have to wear a shirt under. I'm just feeling lazy. And it's the kind of thing, it's the kind of thing that it's hard to safety pin yourself. But in theory, it would look like this. And I probably wouldn't wear a shirt under. Um, but whatever, I'm wearing it like this for now. I actually wore it like this last all of this, And it looked good. Um, but it's really nice. Again, I'm not wearing leggings because it's summer. But you totally could. And it makes this dress warmer. It's definitely, like, fancier and, like, Again, not my usual vibe, but good job, Mom. I'll show you the detail. It looks a lot, like, grayer and blacker over the camera than it actually is. But it's really nice. It comes in here. It's like a, what is it, rouging? I don't know if that's the word. But it's really nice. I like it a lot. This is just what I've gotten from TJ Maxx relatively recently, slash what is in circulation in my closet. But over the years, I have gotten so many things at tj maxx it's really a win i used to always go camp shopping there you can get like dry fits and sports bras and shorts and pajamas and a million other things i also have this really nice thing at school that can hold three tea lights so i use that for shabbos candles i've gotten just scented candles bath mats whatever but i just wanted to show you the things that i currently wear that i got from either tj maxx or marshall's so i hope you enjoyed let me know if you've ever gotten anything really nice from tj maxx or marshall's and i will see you in my next video mm -hmm.